There's a man sitting next to me, says he's been waiting since half three, he says he's on disability, he says he's been out of work since 1990, he says he's got a head injury, he says he owes the dole a shitload of money, he says he can never pay it back, the price, the number his bank account's never been at, he says he swears to me that tomorrow he'll grab a straight razor, smuggle it in via pencil case, and when he sits down with his smug horn beast, he'll whip it out, run the fucking across his own neck, bleed out, scream and shout, YOU FUCKING DID THIS! He takes a deep breath. Son, I'm feeling fucking stressed. It's an open plan labyrinth. Instead of walls, they've got paperwork. Instead of a minotaur, they've got low level civil servants. On their own, just a simple human. Together, they are a system. Ancient eyes sizing you up. Here comes another fuck up, another dull mole, third name on the roll. Man, I'm starting to suspect that they don't allow drinks to affect my mental state. I've been waiting since half eight. I've got a dry throat. The fans got me shivering with the cold. Man, I would say anything if I could just go home. <gasps> I think they took my juice because they don't have the technology yet to take my soul! But I, they're working on it in a cavern underneath the labyrinth. Dr. Benway walks away in a chemical that, when ingested, will dilute the subject and thinking all its primary needs, food, water, sunlight, hope, are being cared for. That bit was easy. The tricky part is maintaining a constant state of anxiety because it's not a fear that screams. It's a feeling like... You're forever about to sneeze. It's my own unspoken assumption that I'm lazy and lack any social function, that I couldn't get a job if I tried. Reinforced when the door lady gets wide, it's the mundane reality that there's no hope, no way out, and no money. Once they synthesize the JSA solution, they'll automate retail. The Minotaur will grow a hydraulic tail, and buses will drive themselves. Instead of the door, they'll give us the miracle cure. But they'll probably still mix up the bottles and make you vomit up your feelings with interest if you're late to the meetings and cutting your own throat won't do no good. They'll sew you up. Cause they are steel. And you are rotten wood.